you give me something that will remind me of you? <laughs> yes, I can. Yes, I can. I can give you a whole lot of something, Just baby. To show you I oh, shit. Here we go again. Howdy, folks. How the hell are you? Welcome back to Bully Scholarship Edition and... We just woke up, we just rolled out of bed, we just finished our morning constitution, came over here, got dressed, and now it's time to get to class. Because everybody knows that Jimmy Hopkins, if he wants to be president of these United States of America, needs to at least get himself a high school education. And what better place to get it than at Bullworth Academy? He said earlier that we're 15, and I don't remember what age I was at 15, but I knew I was about to be able to drive, so I'd say I was at least a sophomore in high school. I was thinking I was in middle school this whole time, but I am, in fact, in high school. So with that being said, you know what it was like to be in high school. Everybody knows what it was like to be in high school. Hey, your grandpa died and leave you his wardrobe? Huh? What was that? What was that, oh boy? You make fun of my grandpappy? My grandpappy died this year, huh? You think you're funny, boy? You think you're funny? Huh? Huh? Okay. I might have overreacted a little bit there, but that old boy had it coming. Alright, he was asking for a good old-fashioned ass whipping. And now we're in biology class. Hello, children. Welcome to the world of biology. I hope you all have strong stomachs. I sure as hell do. Oh, we're dissecting stuff? Okay, complete the dissection as accurately as possible before class ends. Uh, left sticks to aim the pointer. A to select or identify. A to use. R to slow pointer. Ah, fuck it. We don't need it. So, let's just, we're, we're dissecting a frog first. Okay. I have done this before, it's not too bad. Anybody here not dissect a frog? Cause I feel like that's just a part of being, you know, uh, becoming an adult. What's oh. the matter? Don't you like cutting things open? Yeah, of course I do. Like bags of tater chips. This smells like my grandma's house, like formaldehyde. Oh, come on. There we go, there we go. Oh, we're slicing him in diet. Patience, in Hopkins. You can't rush science. I, I can rush science, all right? Don't don't you use forceps to peel back the skin flaps, okay? Yeah, there we go. Oh. Oh. Yeah, look at that. We're looking at his intestines. His heart is tummy. Okay, we're gonna identify the heart right there. Yep, that's a heart. Use scalpel to cut around the heart. We're cutting his heart out! Oh my gosh! I do not remember this being in the original game. I would have remembered something like this. This needs to have like a, like a T for TV 14 rating on it. Oh, that smells great. It smells, it smells like your grandma's house. Doesn't it? Now let's identify the stomach. Let's cut out the stomach. All right, we're already sitting at 66% harvested. I don't know what we're doing, but I do, I, I, I do know that we are basically harvesting this frog. And I am getting really good at that. I just scooped this guy's tummy out like it was nothing. Eat your heart out, Kermit. Use your magnifying glass and identify the intestines. I mean, Kermit the Frog, you know, this is his his cousin, Hermit. But why do their names have to rhyme? I don't, I don't know. But Hermit the Frog here got caught Remember, shoplifting at the, the local Costco. And then they donated his body to science and they're letting the little high school kids Hopkins. chop him up. Let's see if you can keep it up, shall we? What is that supposed to mean? You think I can't pass your class? Booyah! I always knew I could do it. I unlocked. Whoa. Yeah, what do you need? Oh. We got some more of Hopkins Security for Firm emissions. We gotta get Tubby Tubby over 
back on over to his library so he can play his Dungeons and Dragons and read his comic books. Which is fine, I love comic books. Ain't nothing wrong with liking a good old fashioned comic book. But you know what the problem is? Is the problem that I'm gonna have to get some bloody knuckles by whooping, whooping down on some, on some gosh damn bullies in this school. There's only one of us that could be the king of the castle. Yeah, Algy, get him, boy. Roll a 26 and kick his ass. Hey, hey, stop. Yeah, you don't care, obviously. Algy, let's go, man. I ain't got all day. After I escort you to the library, I got another class to get to because we don't cut class here. I need to get me that high school education. And once I pass all my classes, I can continue to rule this school. This school is for morons. But if I'm going to be working on my political angles of ruling, and, you know, oh, 15. Oh, thank you for the tip. My, I should have opened the gosh damn door for you with a tip like that. By golly, I only charged five bucks and you tipped me 10. Okay, I'll remember that. Next escort service is not... Uh, no, we're not going to call it an escort service. Next security service is not going to be on the house, but but I'll double my efforts, all right? I'll bring a, a can of bubbly or something with me, all right? We'll get you something good. Get you some num-nums. Now, what class could I possibly have next? I've done... Are you hey, I am not cutting class. I am on my way to class. Of course, you wouldn't know that. Now, would you? Home act. Music. Hello, boys and girls. Oh, hello, Miss Peters. Peters. And I'm going to be your music teacher this year. Yes, you are. Play along with the song. Stay on time to pass your class. When the scrolling icon enters the box, pull the corresponding option. Okay. Want we'll to play some cowbell? Is that what I'm seeing? Huh? Yeah. More cowbell. This needs more cowbell! <laughs> yep, yeah, I'm Jimmy. Jimmy freaking Hopkins. I play the cowbell. Make all the girls yell. I don't know how to rap, so I'm gonna sound like crap. Hey, that rhyme, and it's in time, so I am in line, playing my damn cowbell until she goes to hell. I don't know anything about rapping, I just know I had to rhyme, and that shit Jimmy, rhymed that was real actually nice. On time. Great job. It's a work in progress, that Jimmy. <laughs> it's a work in progress, Jimmy. Hey, you! You look ugly in that sweater. <laughs> yeah, that's right, I said it. Yeet! Uh, superhero landing, baby! Now it's the moment y'all have been waiting for. I done passed both of my classes for the day. We only do two classes a day. Now I get to do something cool. I get to go play some kind of mission. Because you know what? Playing the damn cowbell is not going to get me a high school diploma. And it's not going to keep me in charge of all these fools up in this dang school. So with that being said, let's get on to defending Bucky. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that out. Stop, Gary. <clears throat> I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel I, your filthy little fantasies? Get, get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or, okay. wait, do you like the okay. boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening Ow. him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. That's and I I've got a weak bladder. <gasps> oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. 
Now run along, Ow! peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want Fine. the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you going to do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off. <laughs> Sorry. <Boop>. Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Gary is a certified jerk face. Jerk wad. Jerkith of the jerkist. He's the jerkiest jerker in jerker town. All right, he is a massive quantity of just jerk. There is nothing nice about that man. He thinks he's gonna take over this school with my help. No, I'm gonna take over this school, and if you intend to stop me, you're gonna have to fight me. And guess what, Gary? We all know you ain't fighting me. All right, ain't nobody at this school, man or woman enough, to take me down. All right, I am Jimmy Hopkins. All right, I used to fight kids just before I started my day. Well, someone is here. Look at that. Look at that. Uh, get in there. Yeah, get that. Get some. Get some. Bucky, de defend yourself, Bucky. Bucky, I. You gotta fight back a little bit, buddy. The man was beating you with a baseball bat. Use your Dungeons and Dragons training. Summon your inner magician. Don't go that way. Okay, and I gotta help. Okay, so we gotta help him get in the garage. Listen here, Bucky. Bucky All right, I, I, I'm gonna. Come on, Gosh, get you, get. Why are you beating a man with a baseball bat? All right, there is picking on somebody, and then there is assault and battery with a deadly weapon. I hate to tell you, but I already know which one you're in, and it is assault battery. Give me your freaking Coca-Cola. I don't know if you pooped out that Coca-Cola, but it's mine. Better than stealing lunch money because I don't have to actually go cash the check. I don't have to ask your daddy for permission from the trust fund. I can just take your cola and move on. Oh, why did that knock me down? Whoa! What the hell is that? Why are you guys using weapons? All right, back in my day, all it took was a gosh damn fist of cuffs. See which one of us could beat the other man down into submission with their bare hands. It's a whole lot manlier than trying to beat them down with a weapon. What, why did you break Get that? It, Keep it down. Who are you? Who are you? Oh, thank you, buddy. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Hell yeah! Thanks to me, that's great. Here, take this. Ooh, I got the skateboard for protecting Bucky? Oh, that's worth it. That's worth it. Now I can cruise around in style. There we go. Done. Everybody be like, ooh, you look like Tony Hawk. And I'll be like, I mean, I don't, but thanks for noticing. Uh, why are you attacking me, Russell? Whoa. Ollie. What? Oh, 360. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. Come at me. Who's gonna come and get some of this? Ready for this? Ready for this? Into the dormitory. Oh, that looks slick. I don't care who you are. That looked, that looked good. Oh, I'm not supposed to be in here, am I? Oops. Oh, well. Oh, well. Nobody's gonna know. That bitch. Give it back. Or what? Or, well, just... Give it back! Are you threatening me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back! You can't just steal things from me! <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, Spotty. Give it back! And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. Oh, I see you undressing you. me with your eyes, sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll, I'll kiss you. Oh, uh, that's okay. Oh, well, okay, but 
If you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up. I mean, all you had to really do was lean into that cancer spiel, all right, baby? I mean, my great-grandpappy died of cancer, so I, you know, it makes me feel good that I'm giving back, especially if you're going to cure the cancer. Plus, that cheerleader was a royal behotch. And, uh, I don't take kindly to people. Hold on a second. You want some of this? You want some? Get, get some. Come get some. Oh! Hey! That is a... Did you just grab me by the scruff of my neck? Ain't nobody but my daddy allowed to do that. I thought I was gonna have a, have a nice spiel to say to the young Beatrice. About her getting bullied and me gonna be like, hey, I understand getting bullied. I used to be bullied. And then you know what? I started beating they I started beating the bullies. I started beating them down, and guess what? Suddenly they're all about the whole, hey, maybe we should be nice to this guy thing. Why is this stuff lying around everywhere? Yeah, I don't know the answer to that either. We gotta hurry. We gotta hurry, Jimmy. Jimmy! Respect our staff at all times, Hopkins. This is your only warning. Don't mess up again. And that's the last I want to hear of you, Hopkins. Knife hand to me, brother? Are you knife hand to me, brother? You better not be. Excuse me, will you help me, please? No, I ain't got time. I've got to help Beatrice. I've got to go try and help Beatrice, but I think I, if I remember correctly, I've got to restart the mission and then head over there. But since the school is, oh, uh, since, oh, damn it, the mission's ended because she, because I couldn't go to the school after hours, so that's a bit of a bummer. Well, hey, 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 whoa, whoa, why don't you break up that that nice, lovely couple they're making out? Come on! I can't believe she asked me this. Of course I'm the center of my universe. Sheesh. What? Hi, it's me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ready for it, ready for it. Ooh, that's how we stop. On a dime. They kicked me out of the girls' dorm. I'm not sweating it. Take you think you, you think you were? I guess what? While you were getting busy getting kicked out of the dorm, I was in there stealing sweet digits. Get some. Get freaking riggedy riggedy wrecked! <laughs> Add an insult to injury. What of it? No, not. You want some of this? No. And what are y'all? What are you? What are you pretty young things doing in my neck of the woods? Hey baby. I look like an idiot, but I'm a nice However, guy. Trust me. Can you give me something that will remind me of you? <laughs> yes, I can. Yes, I can. I can give you a whole lot of something, Just baby. To show you I care. This is so sweet. Oh, come here, baby. Come here, baby. Give me a smooch like right here. Mm. Oh, that's that. There's more where that came from, you baby. It's just awful. I mean, it's so wrong. Woo! I heard like 10 people made out. Oh, uh, yeah, and I, I made out with all... Oh, you're fighting over me! Uh, fighting over me! Hey, I know, babies, I know. I'm Jimmy Hopkins. I'm one hell of a catch. All right, I'm too much man for even one woman. All right, that's why. You know, you know, you know, when it, it's gonna be a little bit awkward, I'll be honest. Whenever young Jimmy Hopkins, young Jimmyth of the Hopkinsith family line heritage, Jimmy Hopkins... THE Jimmy Hopkins from Bullworth Academy. Whenever I become president of these United States, it's gonna be interesting because there's gonna be more 
than one first lady. There's going to be a first, a second, and a third lady, if you catch my drift. Give it back. Or what? Or, well, just give it back. Are you threatening me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back. You can't just steal things from me. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, 